Hey, so I'm here for my first unboxing video. Um, I ordered some things from a brand called Le Femme Noir, uh, which is another sect of sort of like uh, Vixen by Micheline Pitt. So Micheline Pitt is this amazing designer I discovered who makes these really like, like really like mm, high quality sort of uh, I don't know if the word is like pin up but they're just very like they're like contemporary takes on like really well fitted clothes <laughs> like I don't know I don't know how else to explain it anyways on the Femme Noir she has a section that's like all about um, Vampira and it's like apparently like official Vampira stuff and I want like everything anyways a while ago I saw she had like a pre-order for Vampira sunglasses so I don't know if you guys know the like iconic sort of Vampira sunglasses with like the bat wings and the paint on them I bought both pairs um, so I already have the black and gold pair and it's already been opened and stuff. I can probably show you in another video like what they look like, but I saved the all black pair to show you the unboxing because I thought when I opened the gold and black pair, like the way this was packaged and shipped was so careful and so like, I don't know, it was an expensive pair of shades, but I was so happy with the like quality, not only of the product, but of like, the shipping and the handling like the way that the object was handled so the first thing when I came when I got it was that it came in this box it says Le Femme Noir it's like a heavy cardboard sort of box um, but it's like quite heavy big rectangular box and um, this isn't like it has like a coating on it or something like some type of plastic coating and it's like quite a nice box I'm gonna save both of them and the other interesting thing is that these both like the gold pair has this written in gold and this the black pair had it written in silver which is really really cool um so anyways I'm gonna open this up and check it out okay so when you open it up I don't know if you guys can see this there's like, um, oh, that's upside down, sorry. There's like a picture of a, like multiple swords and there's just, it's like this shining on top of matte. It's really, really pretty. And it says La Femme Noir again, just really high quality packaging. And inside it's sort of this like, see it's quite a like nice box. It has like a, extra edge on it so that it closes really nicely and inside I guess this is the glasses case so when I first got this I wasn't sure if it was gonna come in their coffin case or not and I actually ordered both shades and then I ordered a coffin case as well which um, I can show you that in a sec but I use that for my other sunglasses so this case it's still like a pretty hard case it actually looks a lot like the box um, and it's like a large case, so I wasn't sure like, oh, it's gonna be inside. Okay, this is the case. Is it gonna come here? So, when I open it up, I have this really cool experience. There's this little card, and it's got like the symbol. And it says Le Femme Noir again. And then there's writing on the back, which I'll read to you in a sec. And then on the case, as you can see, it says Vampira by Le Femme Noir, which is really cool. And when you pop it open, you see the, this is the, um, like, cloth to clean it. So everything's just really custom. And I noticed this has silver writing as well. So I'm not sure, I can't remember if my gold pair has um, gold writing or silver writing. I'm thinking it's probably gold, but I'll double check next time because I actually leave my gold pair at my husband's house. So I'll just like, I don't know where to put this so you can see it. Anyways, I'll read you the little, little card. It says, The Bat. Inspired by the most iconic glamour ghoul, our vampire by Le Femme Noir bat glasses 
are the reimagined update of Vampire's most famous sunglasses. These incredibly articulate glasses are made of high quality imported Italian acetate with polarized lenses to reduce glare and UV 400 protection, UVA slash UVB, that protects your precious eyes from harmful UV rays. The frames are ophthalmalic. I don't know how to say that word. Ophthalmalic? Ophthalmalic? Quality frames and can hold prescription lenses within 500 diopters. Please take care of your sunglasses by using the included microfiber cloth to wipe. Keep away from intense heat and cold. For customized fit, please see your optometrist to help adjust the frames for you. La Vampire by Le Femme Noir. That's really cool when it says the bat. So they have like a similar pair of glasses and I'm really curious if they come in like different packaging. Um, but they have like a simpler pair of glasses that's about half the price and they also have kind of like this bat design, but they're not vampiro ones. Um, I'm really curious about the differences between the two. So there's that. Um, yeah, let's check out, I want to check out this little cleansing cloth. So it has this really cute edge even, like there's so many little details that are really beautiful. So this is the microfiber cloth. And it has this like very cute little scalloped edge. Actually, it's quite, I don't know, it's just like a little simple little details that are making it like feel very high quality. Um, really interesting about the write up. I didn't realize. Oops. Sorry. I didn't realize that the um, glasses would be able to for sure fit like a lens and I'm kind of considering like because I have two pairs should I get a pair that are like glasses um I'm really not sure about that but uh, I love my other pair the like looking through them is just wonderful anyways so we just got the we got the shades left so here's the box, and uh, the box is like velvety inside as well. I don't know if you can see that. My lighting's really shitty, sorry. Um, so here you go, and it comes in like a sealed bag, and it looks like there's something to protect everything from being scuffed and all of that. So, yeah. There we go. So like they've got the arms protected and the shades protected, which is really nice. I'm just gonna slip those off. So right away I see, check this out. There's little moons. So this one has silver. I'm pretty sure my other one has gold. Or no, this is gold. Sorry. This is gold. And there's this really cute little detail. Ooh, these are very cool. Okay, I was... So these are very similar to sort of the vampire glasses. And I have to get the rest of their stuff. They have a whole series. I really want to get the bathing suits. I'm going to Hawaii soon, and I would really like to get the vampire bathing suit. And also maybe the Beetlejuice one, just because it's like really cool. Like she has amazing designs that I just don't see anywhere else. And they still like, for instance, the those bathing suits are so cool because they give you some form. Like a lot of her clothes have like, they have sort of like they're they're stitched in these really ingenious ways to give you like a visible waist or like exaggerate if you already have a waist. And some of the women I see, because I'm part of, they have a thing. Uh, on Facebook for like vixens so like people who purchase her products and some of the women on there have like tiny tight waisted waisted waists and they fit into like but it looks amazing like if you have any waist at all <laughs> I think even if you don't I've seen some people who are like you don't think that they have a really like extreme waist but then they put on the vixen clothes anyways so here's the shades um, as you can see so they're, uh, they're like, it said they were, I believe they're like high quality acetate. Um, this is the inside. So you can see there's like the, um, these are built in. So if they don't fit on your nose, they might not fit you, but 
uh, the other pair I have fits me like really well. Um, oh, and also it looks like it says Vampira by Le Femme and Noir. Sorry, you just saw the, my nails are kind of grown out. And then on the other side, it just says Vampira Bat Polarized, UVA, UVB made in China. And there's a lot of really cool little details. Even the way the arm is held is really nice. It has like this nice sleek, everything's very sleek. Um, I love the other pair. You can see the details more, but yeah. So there's like a bat in the center and his wings are your eyes. Uh, I just love Vampire. I love her like sort of classic sense of humor. Like I know that all there is is like little clips and pictures, but sort of the like just the intro video of her just like screaming and it's like horrifying and just hilarious at the same time I just like yeah so hopefully I'm getting good image and uh yeah so the wings kind of like bump out there's the moon is there any other little details here it is from the very top above the back is flat the front as you can see his nose like sort of projects and there's like little, little sort of veins for his wings and uh, his little, his little feet, his little tootsies. Well, it's not really feet, but it's like his little sort of legs or whatever. It's like bumped out. Anyways, let's try these babies on. So, um, I love these. I love my other pair. That's the other reason I'm not like spazzing out right now. They're so different than anything like anyone I know has. Um, and I just, I don't know. I, I find them so like, they just like jazz up any outfit in like a really cool way. And I feel like these, like they just have this instant super glam artsy sort of thing that happens. The one thing I will say is with this black pair, at least on camera it's picking up, I feel like I should have drawn my eyebrows higher which was like the very vampire look so I should have probably drawn them up there like I don't these aren't real <laughs> I draw on my eyebrows like every single day so imagine my eyebrows are up here I feel like like higher eyebrows would suit these glasses slightly better because right now it kind of looks like my eyebrows are growing out of my glasses because they're pretty um, arched and they don't quite cover your eyebrows but my gosh like Actually, I should mention the lipstick I'm wearing today. I totally didn't do this on purpose, I swear. But this is Kat Von D Vampira. Mix, it's mixed with a little bit of another color, a lighter color. But it's Vampira, and gosh, does it look glam with these glasses. <laughs> so, yeah, I feel like these are really, like, if you wore these, these would just, like, jazz up anything, really. Like, I feel like a gothic queen I feel like as vampire as I can possibly be and I don't know I just feel so mystical and special and I I don't know I feel like spending extra money to get something like like this like an accessory like this is something that as long as I take care of it I will use my whole life and it's just so amazing I mean anyways I really highly recommend these and in terms of my review um so my other pair I've worn out quite a bit and what I will say is that they are, yeah, they're polarized which is amazing when you're walking around like they have this way of just like perf perfectly like giving you the perfect shade <laughs> um, and they adjust to sort of the light quality. They have this really interesting sort of color. I don't know how to explain it. They make things sort of shimmery sometimes, which is really cool. Um, they're really, really high quality glasses. I love them. I'm so happy I bought two pairs. I mean, it was, it was a bit of an expense, but like, come on guys. Come on, look at this. How could you not? How could you not? Um, I'd really like to get her other pairs as well, the cheaper ones, and I'm seriously considering like, give me some feedback. Do you think that this should be glasses? 
because like I'm kind of I actually kind of prefer these as as um oh if you want to see the fit also like that fits on my face um I don't know they sit on my nose really well uh I will say I have a really small nose so I'm not sure if it would be different on someone else because like I said this is built in um, the arms fit me perfectly. They're quite a small pair of glasses. My uh, my husband and his friend both tried them on, the other pair, and they uh, found them very tight. So if you have like a really wide head, uh, these are a little tight, but you can also go to an optometrist and get the arms adjusted. These fit me like absolutely perfect, but I have like a tiny head and a tiny nose. Um, yeah, they stay right up. They don't touch your cheeks, which I like. And they also don't touch your brows, which is really nice. Like the head, at least on me, it kind of like pushes here, like it's touching. And it forces this part to lift off. So it's really nice because my um, eyebrows don't get smudged. And I don't know if that's an intentional thing or if that's just a design thing, but that's definitely like, a major bonus for me because like I said I draw my eyebrows and I find that often wearing shades they just they get all muddled usually right around here um so yeah they keep the shades off of my face anyways I just wanted to give a quick review these are really high quality really beautiful and I highly recommend them And they just, I don't know, I feel so cool. Like, look at them on my head. I just look like a cool babe. Cool babe. Anyways, peace out, Girl Scout. Hope you get some cool shades.